Thank you for buying this 15669 microscope from Fixture Displays. I want to show you how to assemble this together and how to use this microscope. This instruction sheet is included along with the, uh, a CD, the monitor, and the lens. It has a film that you want to peel off. And the stand, connector, wires, and base. To begin, we want to fasten the connector piece uh, made from aluminum to the aluminum base with these two thumb screws. And the underside has four rubber pads. Corrections, the screws actually require an Allen wrench that is provided. Now we're going to fit the stand pole portion into the little connector. You want to make sure the plastic nut is uh, in between. We'll come to a position that requires a little uh, fine tuning. I'm going to turn, loosen the nut tight, turn, and then tighten. I'm going to put a little uh, uh, o-ring in there before we insert the lens assembly. Now if it does not fit perfectly, we want to cut off the excess to make sure the fit is proper. Then we're going to fasten the set screws to secure that in place. And you can adjust the height to desired position. Adjustment range is 10 millimeter minimum to 40 millimeters. We're going to give you some measurements of this unit. Front to back is 5.8 inches, overall height 8.5 inches. The entire width is 4.8 inches that is measuring the monitor. This product weighs 2.2 pounds, so it's very easy to move around and take it with you. To operate, you want to turn on the on-off button. And there are times you need to remove a cover, just pull it off from the lens. In this case, they're already off. And there's a menu button. You hold on that, and then you would toggle between camera and uh, video camera functions. You see that little icon? Now it's a camera, a video camera. So that's your indication. And then the, in the back, there is an SD card slot. The card is not included. In this case, we have inserted one for demo purpose. On the side, there is a micro USB connection port. We're going to show you how that works uh, shortly. There is a battery housing. You can uh, uh, put in a battery. And this is the battery specifications. We're ready to demo. We have a small flower. It's actually a L'Oreal flower. And this is how we zoom or focus. There is a uh, LED light control button to adjust the brightness. Depending on your lighting condition and the object you are trying to examine, there is a 
uh, preferred lighting condition as well as focus that you would want to find depending on the distance you are viewing this object. The technical specification allows for up to 200 times magnification. Uh, that uh, varies depends on the object you are observing and the conditions of your lab. Now this is the video camera function where you click the OK and then you start to tape record. And click OK again, that will stop. Now it has stopped. This gives you the recording length. And if you hold the menu button, that shows the recorded video. And if you have multiple videos, you can browse using the left right arrow. Now we hold that and enter into camera option. We now switch to a blue flower and as you can see it's out of focus at this moment. We're going to adjust focus until it's perfectly clear. Again you can adjust the lighting condition. For desired results. Now you can click on OK to take a photograph. A photograph is saved. This is the instruction you can work with a uh, PC or a Mac and these are the software download instructions. If you have any questions, feel free to email us cs the charlie sam at fixturedisplays.com. Uh, little warning the demo software, the uh, instructor used a Chinese version, but uh, rest assured the software has English option. When you install the software, there is an advertising pop up. Ignore that, there's, it's harmless, uh, there's no virus, so don't be afraid. Again, you will be working with the English software if you selected English. This is the home screen. And before we connect the microscope to the computer, we want to toggle, uh, hit the menu button until scroll until we see a USB option and then select USB by click on OK. Under that, there is a PC cam and we want to select OK again. Now we're going to get out of that menu and then connect the USB and the micro USB port. Once connected, the monitor starts to show PC camera And we're going to have this uh, yellow flower back to demonstrate. Now this is how the computer screen show. It's a real-time image. You can take photograph by clicking that button right there. And that will save a photograph. And then there are tabs, images, and video that you can toggle between and this is the video option you can click and then start to shoot a video and by double clicking or open you can view those images and then scroll left and right
I encourage you to browse FigureDisplays.com for other products and services we have to offer. If you have any questions, email us cs.charliesam at FigureDisplays.com. Now, as you take a video of an object, in this case a coin, you want to uh, zoom in or focus. You may even want to adjust the height for best magnification results. Now, once you find the proper distance and focus, you can move the objects slowly to examine the entire object, certainly depending on the size of the uh, item you are viewing. You can then record a video for your examination process. In this case, we are getting really close. I'm going to adjust the focus to find the best viewing details. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember, leave a good seller feedback along with the product review. Also consider subscribe to our YouTube channel for upcoming products and services we have to offer. This is a great item uh, for your work hobby or even as a gift to a uh, teenager, uh, to someone uh, love to study things. Or a hobbyist who collects stamps, baseball cards, etc. And this can give you a lot more information than looking with your naked eye. Thank you once again for shopping fixture displays.